so y'all i did not plan on vlogging today but i up uploaded a video so i just made some bacon some sausage some eggs some pancakes and some potatoes for me my mom my sister and her boyfriend well and her baby daddy so yeah they they them through sleeping but me and mama finna eat i'm finna eat lay in my bed relax see y'all later so y'all i'm looking crazy y'all crazy thing is y'all haven't even seen my hair but this is my hairstyle that i got for my birthday um for my birthday i didn't really go do nothing like literally i was supposed to go out i never did that um i was supposed to have a girls night but i didn't i'm not having a girls night um i like kind of had a girls night it was me my cousin and my sister we just drunk smoked and did my hair that's literally everything we did but i love my hairstyle period book my cousin she gonna get you right every single time i haven't admired just yet today because you already know but it's currently like 12 something i'm about to find me an outfit to put on <coughs> find me an outfit to put on and then take me a shower so i'm about to go through my clothes find an outfit all of that i currently need to wash laundry but i'm just not in the mood to wash laundry today so i'm gonna probably wash laundry thursday which is tomorrow but anyways i'm about to just go take a shower get out brush my teeth wash my face again because i don't know is it just is it just me but like when you get out the shower even if you brush your teeth this morning you have to brush your teeth again i don't know but we're gonna do that um as y'all can see i put all the the bottles together because they had just came out the um sterilizer um the other bottles the dirty bottles from last night are currently in scalding hot water when those are done we will have to um put those in the sterilizer so yeah that's life also today i'm going my mom wants me to go with her to she just found a lady selling some bottles for like really cheap and we have a whole bunch of bottles but like we didn't really realize how many bottles we were gonna need i would say we probably have like 25 bottles right now but it's just like we keep having to wash them just to use them like we can't even every day we're washing bottles every single day i'm not even kidding so we need more small bottles we got a whole bunch of like big ones so yeah we're gonna go get some bottles and then we're gonna go pick up some clothes and some diapers from this girl that we grew up with we grew up around her she just had a daughter about like two months ago so her daughter cannot fit preemie and newborn anymore so she's gonna give us all of those clothes for my niece where those clothes are gonna go i don't know because like we don't have no room my niece has a full dresser and a full closet to herself and she's still taking over my sister's closet in my sister's room like i'm not even kidding my niece have 75 newborn outfits and yeah she has clothes all the way up to 2t so we've been shopping for a very long time but yeah that's what i'm about to do y'all i'm about to just find me an outfit i currently have like all of these size 8 polo tees and i'm getting ready to take pictures of all of them and post all of them on facebook for sale so yeah just stay tuned hey y'all currently in the car at walmart doing my walmart pickup picking up some taco salad stuff and some spaghetti stuff today we're gonna have taco salad tomorrow we're gonna have spaghetti so i'm telling i just left i'm gonna lick my lips y'all they dry as fuck i just left myers we went and got some watermelon some donuts like some just some little stuff for the house currently eating some of these mama just walked over to the vending machine to get um whatever it's called y'all i haven't even been giving y'all hauls but yesterday i got my niece four outfits and they're all cute as fuck i got her dressed up today when her mama sleep while my sister was asleep but i just got her some new ones another new one yesterday i got her preemie because she cannot fit newborn she has to wear preemie but i got these in newborn because they didn't have them in preemie and she needs these so it comes with a jacket some jogging pants and a shirt and then it's these little fits so yeah we're gonna go home we're gonna go show her mom we're gonna go show her dad because they're all at home i just showed her dad this morning the um 
other outfits I got for her because I came to Walmart yesterday and I got her a whole bunch of cute outfits. Excuse me, I'll have to like show y'all one day. Um, I had got her a bow, I got her some outfits with some matching mittens. Um, I got her like a little lemon outfit with like the matching jacket because my sister had got her the lemon pants with the lemon jack with the like lemon shirts, you know. You know, like the pants that come with two pair of pants. My sister got her those, but they're like had little lemons on them with the shirts. But I came to Walmart and I seen they had the lemon outfit in a, with a jacket instead of just like this. So basically just like this, but just the jacket version. So I just went ahead and picked up the jacket version because she already has the other version. But today I went ahead and picked up all versions. And my mom said they also have a sleeper in the same print. We're gonna make sure we get that too. Honestly, y'all, my niece does not need no clothes. She has literally over 75 newborn outfits, but I just can't stop shopping. Like now that she's here, she's a girl, she's so cute. Everything I put on her is so cute. I just be ready to shop, 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 shop. So today, while her mom was getting some sleep, cause my sister does nights and I do mornings. So when my sister was asleep, when my sister was asleep, I got her dressed in a Nike outfit. I'm gonna insert so, a picture. Currently, just chilling, y'all. We had got the groceries, came to the house, and yeah, when we got to the house, I basically just showed my sister and them what I got the baby, and then after that, we ain't, we ain't do nothing after that. I just showed them what I got the baby, and then I came in my room. I had made me some spinach artichoke dip from fridays i bought me one at myers a couple days ago so i went, went ahead and made that i just ate that but i have all of these clothes to fold hang up put away all of that so i'm gonna go ahead and do that because tomorrow i'm gonna fold and put away that other load because tomorrow's friday so i'm probably gonna end up the video on friday and this is gonna be a week in my life because i've literally been recording like for days at this point just have a little clips for days um because saturday me and tay are going to a concert so i'm gonna record um you know get ready with me for the concert i'm gonna record you know a concert video or whatever but i just want to say thank y'all to everybody who was running up that last video um the like when i told y'all why we were moving out the apartment and yeah thank y'all for everybody who was supportive and who was just like you know what i mean there for me because bitch honestly it was very depressing for, to go from you know getting an apartment being scared at first to get one and then finally getting one and going through the whole process to get approved for an apartment and then you know <clears throat> go through the whole process to get approved you paying money to them i literally paid them um first month's rent deposit and something else and yeah i was about to be in the process of getting my wi-fi turned on like god works in mysterious ways it was a reason why i kept saying like no i'm not gonna get my wi-fi turned on today i'm gonna go tomorrow i'm gonna go tomorrow and then like the next day i wouldn't go there i wouldn't go get my wi-fi turned on i would go to the apartment or i would just go do hell the extra shit but yeah so we turned in the keys to the apartment i did that on friday which was last friday so today has officially been i mean tomorrow will officially be a week that my name is off the lease for the apartment um yeah currently not really like looking anywhere else um i am on a whole bunch of like waiting lists for apartments just the same as i was on that waiting list for that apartment i'm on a whole bunch of other waiting lists for other apartments so, yeah, I'm about to just watch YouTube, fold this laundry, and chill. Literally chill. It's not really too much to do. I'm glad I went pee because my sister just went in there and got a shower. But yeah, the baby, she's with my mom, taking a nap. Her mom are taking a nap in mom's bed. And then my sister, she just currently got in the shower. And I'm about to just fold this laundry put this laundry away and then go start dinner because tonight i'm making taco salad i literally bought enough stuff bought a whole bunch of stuff for taco salad but i literally bought two pounds of meat but i'm gonna try to decide like do i want to use two pounds of meat or do i just need to use one pound of meat 
because before it was me Tay, my sister her boyfriend my mom but now it's just you know the rest the rest of us because my sister boyfriend just left real quick so i don't know if he's even gonna be here for dinner but i'm still loving my braids y'all love how crispy my braids are still looking like they're looking good as and i love it um also y'all let me know what i can use on my lips because i be using explode expo ex Expoli Expoliator? Why the fuck can I not say that word? Expoliator. Girl, we ain't even gonna keep trying at this point. You sound stupid. Anyways. Yo. Um, literally, look what we got today. It's a bangles. Um, what is this called? A bangles towel. As well as, I try to like organize our dresser as best as I could. So, like, this is my side, and then, like, that's Tay's side. But the only thing I have on my side is my light hygiene. The rest of this shit is Tay's. Um, and then Tay organized our closet for us. So, in the other room, the closet was, like, bigger. Like, it, that part came out more. And this closet is, like, back. So, we had to, like, organize it like this. But that that's fine. And then over here, you know, I just got my little vanity gear. You don't mind my plate. Girl, I need to take that plate to the motherfucking kitchen. So, yeah, my man's calling me. That means stop work. Peace. So, it's currently 9 a.m. on Friday. I already had told y'all. I will see y'all Friday. I'm going to record all day today. Basically, today, y'all, I'm just really going to be, like, getting my room together because, yeah, I feel like I've been more so, like, you know, cleaning up other stuff or doing other stuff around the house. I just really haven't been tending to my room. The only person... <coughs> The only person that has really been cleaning my room is Tay. So, yeah, I've just been picking up, like, stuff here and there or whatever. But not really too much. Not really doing too much. But, um, I have a whole basket of laundry that needs to be put away. I have a dryer full of clothes that need to be taken out the dryer, folded, and put away. Um, I need to go through my pajama drawer. I need to fold them and, you know, figure out that. Also... I have way too many pajama pants to the point where, like, literally, they're busting out the drawers. So, yeah. <clears throat> also, my niece is right here sleeping. Y'all already know I do morning shifts. So, today I didn't wake up as early as I usually do. So, I usually wake up around, like, 7.30 and I go get her. But today I woke up at, like, 8 o'clock. And I still was tired when I woke up. But, um, yeah. When I got her, she's just chilling literally sleeping i just burped her she already ate her like last ounce that she had but she was eating formula earlier her last bottle was formula because she eats formula at night um but my sister has like a whole bunch of breast milk um in the fridge that we have to start using because you know breast milk goes bad you could only leave it in the fr it's sitting out for four hours and in the fridge for four days so last night i baggied up a whole eight ounces eight ounces of breast milk and i put it in the freezer because her first bath is going to be with breast milk so yeah well her first bath at home i know she had to have a bath at the hospital but her first bath at home is going to be with breast milk or whatever and like my sister's going to be washing her hair with like breast milk and stuff so she had a like a whole eight ounces so i just bagged it up put it in the um freezer but she still had what was it three ounces in another bottle so here goes two i weighed out two it's freezing cold so i put it out now because it can sit out for four hours so in two hours when she's ready to eat it'll be the room perfect temperature and then she had another ounce left i left that in the fridge so yeah she's she's literally transitioning over to formula instead of breast milk because breast milk just i don't know it's really thin and i feel like with breastfed kids she was eating so much like i felt like we was feeding her and then like an hour later we was feeding her two ounces and then like an hour later she was wanting two more and you know it's because this is thin like this is very thin it's not thick at all so she was just hungry more but yeah we were just like now 
well, we wasn't like nothing. My sister was just like, no, she's about to be on formula, especially because my sister's going to be going back to work soon. You know, nobody wants to have a kid that's breastfed and then you all of a sudden can't, you know, produce enough milk for the kid. So we're just like, no, before like she gets to the stage where, you know, you switching her, her stomach messing up and she up crying all night. Before you even get to that stage, you might as well just switch her while she's literally eight days old. She's only eight days old today. So, we're just like, that's what my sister decided. That's what we're doing. But yesterday, I gave her two ounces of breast milk during the day. And then today, I'm giving her two ounces of breast milk during the day. And then the rest of the day will be formula. But we still are giving her breast milk because she's eight days old. Breast milk has some very good benefits. But yeah, so I'm about to just turn on some YouTube. She gonna lay here and sleep. I'm about to put away my laundry and currently like figure out what I'm about to wear to this concert because I have a concert to go to tomorrow. I was gonna go to Soldier Boy concert today, but I've already seen him. So I just kind of decided I'm not even gonna waste my money and go see him again because I've already seen him once. And yeah, tomorrow Saturday, I'm going to see Ice Cube. Tay's mom bought me and him a ticket to go see Ice Cube for his birthday his birthday is um september 22nd but ice cube comes this weekend so boom period but yeah y'all i haven't got to brush my teeth wash my face i haven't got to do nothing yet i'm about to put away my laundry and then i'm gonna go set her in my mom's room and take a shower get myself together brush my teeth wash my face all of that and then i'll come back out i'll get her bring her back in here and just chill and watch tv until Either her dad comes and he wants her or until my sister wake up. So, yeah, that's how we're, like, covering shifts of the baby. My sister do nighttime. I do morning shift. So, yeah. Usually, um, I only have her from, like, 8 to 10 o'clock because her dad usually comes at 10 o'clock every day. So, I usually only have her from, like, 8 to 10. But yeah i'll be so i'll be low-key salty because baby don't be taking my niece y'all one thing about me i'm just so stingy like i'm so stingy over her i barely even want to share her with her mom <laughs> i'm so stingy y'all like i barely even want to share her with her mom like i'm not even kidding so yeah this is the week in our life with the newborn Okay, like literally I've barely been recording. I've barely been doing anything because I've really just been trying to help my sister like adjust to being a new mom. Like, you know, try to help her when she need me to help her. You know, a lot of people be like, oh, you just just come ask me when you need help or you know what I mean? Like, oh, if you need to take a shower, come ask me if I watch her. But I feel like sometimes parents don't want to keep asking. Because they might feel like, oh, I'm asking too much or I'm asking too often. So what I do is, I just ask my sister, like, hey, do you want me to watch her so you can take a shower? Hey, do you want me to watch her so you can get some sleep? Hey, do you want me to watch her so you can whatever the hell you want to do? Literally, my sister had her the baby eight days ago, but I told my sister, like, you're still young. The baby is fine. If you want to go out and have lunch with your friends, you do that because just because you're a mom, life don't stop. Like your personal life don't stop. So I just want to make sure I'm there for my sister, most importantly, in this time right now, because postpartum depression is a motherfucker. And I had a bed on top of grieving. So it was just like double whammy bed. And that's not the baby one. Why are you playing with me every day of your motherfucking life? That's the dog. I swear to God, sometimes, y'all, this dog plays with me. I'm not even kidding. Like, she plays with me. And I'll be ready to tear her ass up. Because what the fuck are you whining for? You're in my room, on the floor, laying on a blanket, what do you what 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 more could you need? You done been outside today. You just came inside. Just was in the living room. You got food, you got water, you got toys, you got treats. What the fuck more could I help you with? 
Lord, you know when they say don't ha don't have kids, get a dog. Fuck no, just don't do just don't do neither. Lord, sometimes the dog is worse than the kids. Pray for me, just pray for me, y'all. What we gonna watch on YouTube or on Netflix? Can y'all give me some Netflix shows in the comments? I love y'all. See y'all later. I pop in with some little clips or some. But if I don't pop in with clips, I love y'all. We'll see you on the next video. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And like I said, baby, this video was a week in my life with a newborn. Because, yeah, my sister is an amazing mother. I just love how she, like, adapted so quickly. Like, she was never, like, a big babysit kids type of person. So I was curious, like, how was this going to go? Because she do not like babysitting. But, bitch... My mama's a good, my, my mama, my sister is a good ass mama. She don't play. So, yeah, y'all, make sure y'all just put congratulations in the comments and stay tuned for more videos. Maybe one day y'all see her face. <laughs> As of right now, I'm about to show y'all her outfit that I put on her last night. Stay tuned. Look at her outfit, y'all. This is the foot part, but her foot is up here because she cannot wear newborn, and this is size newborn. Her little fingers or in there because it's cold but yeah this is our fit period hey y'all i still haven't like fully officially edited the last video i mean this video so i'm just gonna insert this in there but basically we had to get up I would say early but not too early we got up around like 10 30 and we left the house around 11 30. we had to go to the dmv and stand in line for 30 minutes just to get me a new id because the concert that me and tay are going to that y'all will see in the next video so the next video that's coming out will be me and tay going to a concert his mom bought us tickets to the ice cube concert for his birthday because tay likes ice cube so we're going there for his birthday so whether i know the music or not I'm still gonna attend because that's what my man want to do for his birthday his birthday is next sunday but you know the concert is this weekend so we're just going this weekend or whatever but we currently just put up to his friend's house to handle what we got to handle and then um yeah we're about to go back to the house just really chill and hang out we went to the dmv we had to give me a new id i did yeah like i was saying before tay came in and rudely interrupted with his dumb ass music um we're about to head back to the house we went to the dmv early as fuck the line was so long it had low-key zoned me out but it didn't go as slow as i thought it was gonna go it actually was pretty fast but i just got on this acdc shirt from sam with some black biker shorts and then tay just has on that outfit he did just buy some new shoes tell me why the shoes don't even fit they fit they're just tight a little bit but we don't know why they're tight because that's the size he wears and he has that same like style shoe and multiple different other like designs or whatever but i don't know what he gonna do he gonna figure it out what he gonna do but I, what's what's them shoes called yeah he got the animal instinct 11s if any shoe heads out there y'all know what he talking about i didn't even know they had a name like that baby but i was just i just ate me a couple donuts because we didn't eat all day it's currently like one o'clock we're about to go back to the house. One thing about me and Tay, baby, we ain't never up and out this early. So with us being up and out this early is something new. But I just needed some more minutes in my footage. And y'all don't never see Tay. Where you been at the last two videos? <laughs> Some at work slaving. Yeah, y'all haven't seen Tay in a couple videos. The last video y'all seen Tay in was like four or five videos ago because I've been posting more videos about like the apartment. And Tay wasn't in none of the videos about the apartment because Tay was never going to the apartment with me. And then um, the labor and delivery vlog. Everybody really liked that labor and delivery vlog for my sister. I think it was a really good video. And yeah, in this video, y'all gonna get to see a glimpse of my niece's like fingers, but that's all y'all gonna get to see until she's six months old. So we'll see y'all when we're getting ready for the Ice Cube concert. Peace. <laughs>